Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. Good day and welcome back to the Valder BB Show as I move to my next guest. I've got Dr. Maria Ryan. She's the Vice President and a Chief Clinical Officer at Colgate Palmolive. Dr. Ryan, welcome to the Valder BB Show. Hi, Valder. Thank you for having me on your show. Well, we're going to talk about special dental hygiene month I, ahead of uh, Halloween. So I'm going to be a hit with the dentist at, after doing this interview. So I'm so excited to do this. Let's talk about the oral health crisis. What's going on there? Well, Valder, you know, oral disease is a crisis in that it affects half of the world's population. And, and if you think about just... Americans here in the U.S., 65 Americans have untreated tooth decay. And cavities is the most common disease in children. And then if you move on to the adults, nearly 50% of adults have some form of periodontal disease or gum disease. So we really can't ignore this crisis anymore. Is oral health linked to your physical health? Because in the last, I'm going to say must be 10 years, you know, my dentist is taking my blood pressure before we get started. Absolutely. And, you know, the reason he's doing that is because we in, as dentists can really see these connections between oral and overall health. And particularly if you think about adults, if you have untreated gum disease, your risk for a heart attack or a stroke is higher. Right. So they need to, to, to check your blood pressure. Right. It's important for them to know before they even start procedures. But your risk for diabetes is higher, for adverse pregnancy outcomes, for respiratory diseases and diseases like Alzheimer's and, and, and rheumatoid arthritis. And then and if you think about the kids, cavities can impact a child's physical and mental health, their self-esteem and overall well-being. So taking care of your entire body starts with taking care of your mouth. And that's why we believe it's important that you know your OQ, your oral health quotient, like you know your IQ or your EQ. And that is really knowing about these connections we're talking about, Valder, and the preventive strategies you can take and where to seek uh, help for your oral health, going to the dentist or the hygienist. And this is Dental Hygiene Month. All right. So you know your OQs. What are three simple solutions that we can safeguard our healthy future? You could uh, use great preventive strategies, brush twice a day for two minutes, um, use a fluoride-containing toothpaste, floss, use mouth rinses as needed. And, you know, for kids, you can make it fun. You can use our hum connected technologies, which they can compete with each other. They get rewards. Um, you can um, use really great tasting toothpaste we have to make it fun. We have our Hello Unicorn Sparkle, which is like bubblegum flavored, and our Hello Dragon Dazzle, which is blueberry flavored. And we have a program called Bright Smiles, Bright Futures, where we provide information to teachers, to parents, uh, in 30 different languages, which you can download online. And this is really a proven curriculum to improve on their knowledge of oral health and what to do to improve it. And then, you know, we're, we're working with physicians and pediatricians to get the word out. And it's very important to get into the dentist at least once a year. And that's a question that your physician should actually be asking you. When was the last time you went to the dentist? Okay. And I think that's a good question. You know, my dad, and I have a great doctor, you know, he hasn't asked me that. I'm going to ask him about that. Yes, that's a good you question. should, you should ask him. <laughs> I, I, I'm going to ask him when I see him again, because he's a great doctor, but he's never asked me about the dent. He asked me about my sex life, but he hadn't asked me about the dentist. So we're going 
We're going to talk about that, Dr. Ryan. Dr. Ryan, online, where can my uh, audience find this formula of uh, for OQs and having the best opportunity to safeguard? Because you need your teeth as you age, I'm telling you. Yes. Well, I, I will tell you, we have a great website at Colgate.com, which has all of this information. It's the, really the number one website for information on oral care. And it's a great resource and, and it gives great advice for optimal oral health. Um, and, you know, I think being on a show like yours is really important because a lot of people don't know these facts and they don't understand the connections between oral and overall health. And I appreciate you inviting me here, Valder, because at Colgate, you know, we believe everyone deserves a future they can smile about. Well, you made me smile this morning talking about information that can change our lives. And that's what I do. Give people information that will change their lives. Dr. Maria Ryan, thanks for being my guest on the Valder Beebe Show. Thanks, Valder. Take care and keep smiling. Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I host the Valder Beebe Show broadcast on radio and television. And this is My Phone Pouch. My Phone Pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.